Hey guys and gals, A here. Welcome to another episode of EDC. So today I have another pocket dump for you. Want to know what I have carried this past week, week and my thoughts on it? <laughs> Come on back because here we go. All right, guys and gals. So this past week, the wrists have looked the same. I still have my uh, Fitbit Sense 2 with this uh, new Velcro strap. Not, still not sure how I feel about it. It doesn't catch too often, but the bit of Velcro that sticks up will collect different um, like threading from clothes and stuff. Uh, and that's because my wrist is too small for the band, quite frankly. So it is what it is. And then the uh, other uh, wrist, I still have the Casio G-Shock in that black multicam, which I'm really digging. And then just a hair tie, because my hair is not up. Uh, Rocking the Mothman hat uh, from Angry Minnow. Uh, love that hat. One of my favorites for sure. And uh, I think that's it for like EDC jewelry kind of things. Uh, Rocking the, uh, the rings as always. Uh, or at least as always when I'm not reacting to them. And then I don't think I've ever mentioned it, but I do just have a chain. I do just have a, a white gold chain that's around my neck. Uh, no big deal, it is what it is. Some people like jewelry, some don't. Uh, that's just kind of what I've worn since I was like 11 or 12. Uh, all right, so pockets. In the front pocket on my right hand side, I've got a uh, breath strip. I have some coins. I actually have a penny, which I don't normally have, so I must have bought something and ended up with that left over. And then I'm still rocking the 20-sided uh, die that I got at Comic-Con. Uh, great toy to pass the little one when he's, uh, when he's unhappy. I have a little small dice. It takes up very little space in the pocket. I don't even know it's there. But when he needs to be entertained, I can hand that to him and it, it does wonders, actually. It's kind of amazing. And then this little, I, well, we'll start with the knife. My side little leg pocket here. I have a Hogue Deca. Been rocking this one. Really do, do like it. I've been using it a lot more. Uh, I kind of went through a phase when I got it of this was the knife that I carried. And then I just kind of rotated around with other knives. And about a month or so ago, I put this back in my pocket to change it up. And it's been finding its way in my pocket a lot since then. Really great knife. Hogue really does make great stuff. It's smooth, good action, looks good, feels great. Uh, and it's USA made, so rock on, guys. And then uh, clipped inside of my cargo pocket. I'm wearing uh, shorts today. So I've got uh, little uh, 5'11 shorts. I've done a review on them. Really like them. Or, uh, no, 24-7, True Spec 24-7s. Did do a review on them, really like them. I'm wearing those today. And then this is the, what I am uh, enjoying calling, the Convoy S2 Plus A. So the Convoy S2 Plus is this flashlight, but take this off, take this lovely pocket clip off, take this short body off, the short, the body goes like this, take this off and put in a body that is nearly the length of my whole flashlight. So the body is like this much. So you get a light that is, you know, you add the, the head onto it, you add the tail onto it and you get a, a pretty good size light. That's the Convoy S2 Plus and it comes with just like a plain metal black pocket clip. So I actually have a video you could check out where I modded this. And so I put in the shorter body, I changed out the battery that's in there to accommodate it. I added on this pocket clip this is the uh, desert tan coloration for the light, OD green theorem therm pocket clip. And then the last mod I did was I added this magnetic ring here and it kept coming out. So I actually glued it in and uh, I still have uh, full use of the light. Guys, I freaking love this. This thing is amazing. It is a larger sized uh, flashlight. And if I purchase this as, as is, it probably would not see a ton of pocket carry, but I made this light and it's mine. Like currently there aren't 
there aren't many out here just like this. There, there might not be any in this exact coloration with, with the accessories, but this is my light. I made it. And so even though it is a little larger than I would normally carry, it's getting carried. And I freaking love this thing. So it's amazing how when you, when you put your own touch on something, how it, um, at least for me, how it adds value to it. Uh, value that, that might mean nothing to anyone else, but man, does it sure make me smile when I pull this flashlight out and use it. So for this girl who is always changing what she's carrying, maybe that's a ticket. Mod stuff, make it my own, and I might be more likely to carry it longer term. So that is clipped to the uh, cargo pocket. And then inside the pocket itself, I have two items. I have my mini Bic with the uh, Gorilla Tape, T-Rex Tape on the outside. Uh, I think that is Gorilla Tape. And then I am still rocking my Blackout Victorinox Farmer. The Farmer uh, has the saw. So this is their, the Swiss Army Knife's Alox line. Um, and it has these right here. You got your different size drivers on the end. You got a bottle opener, can opener, and right down below this, you have your wire stripper. Uh, and then we have the large blade. And then the last item we have is the awl, the awl or the reamer, whatever you want to call it. But uh, yeah, and then the, the saw, like I showed you to begin with, that's what kind of makes us the farmer as opposed to a cadet or whatever the case. But thin little, little, uh, you know, multi-tool knife. And uh, it's been riding in my pocket for a couple weeks now. Really like it. It does disappear. But when I need it, I have it. So that's made the cup for a while now. Uh, back pocket, I have a little bit of cash on me. Back left pocket, I have a, uh, a Hank. Uh, the two-year-old is uh, allergies are acting up right now. We are green. We are blooming down here. And uh, his allergies are going crazy. So that has been a staple on me. And what's sad is we're not in allergy season yet. So yay. Um, but it does mean I am carrying a handkerchief on me all the time. That's not a fancy one. That is one that is for little dude's nose. Uh, I'm not wiping my phone with that. And then uh, the Axwell wallet is still, still holding, holding strong as my wallet. I actually need to stop carrying this wallet so that I can review some I've been sent and it just won't leave my pocket. <laughs> Like here it still is. I seriously, after this video, I need to take the items out of this and go put them in a new wallet and test that one out. Um, but I freaking love this wallet. It's thin, it's small, it's always in my pocket, holds some cash in it. Like it's, it's great guys. If you haven't checked it out, check it out. And I have a, uh, use the code EDC when you're checking out and you'll save 10% and that's on anything at Axwell's website. You can save 10% on anything, your whole order. So check them out, highly recommend it. Like, I'm not a front pocket wallet person, and I actually have a wallet incoming that I've wanted to try for months. And I finally got the wallet, and it, it's been here for probably two or three weeks now. I literally will not stop carrying this to carry the wallet I was waiting on. So that tells you something. And then the last item I've got is my Pixel Buds. Love these things, great to listen to. Uh, like I never knew the utility, I mean, whatever you listen to, YouTube videos, podcasts, books, whatever. But uh, I never knew how much I would actually use these until I have them on person. And uh, I think that's the ticket for me is, is it is a, a bit of a larger item, but all those times where I'm like, man, I'll listen to a podcast right now or I'll watch a YouTube video, but I don't want to disturb whoever's around me or I'm trying to put my two year old to sleep or whatever it is. With these, I can do that. I can pop these in my ear or just one in my ear. Uh, left, I'm a left ear listener. So I'll pop one in my left ear and uh, still be alert with my right and know what's going on. But I can listen to or do whatever it is I wanted to do on my phone. So uh, yeah, they, they have made the permanent pocket location for me. So there you go, that's been my carry this week. The main change up was this and I was carrying just this in my pocket for a week or two, and I added the Hogue Deca because that wasn't cutting it for me. So there you go, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. What have you been carrying this last week? Definitely let me know down below. 
And uh, yeah, I will never ask you to like or subscribe. You do you. But I would definitely appreciate it if you did both. Definitely comment below and let's get a conversation going. And I will be back soon with some videos. Got a lot of fun stuff coming up. I've been releasing some of those videos. More to come. So stay tuned. Uh, it is, it's, yeah. I know I say this a lot recently, but it is very exciting time here at the channel and we do have a lot going on. So thanks for being a part of the ride. You guys make it fun and I will be back with a new video. So remember, EDC, EDC.